<laughs> you've, you've had some some moments to celebrate over the last while and probably the one that would resonate most with you i'm sure would have been the olympics and watching tatiana in fact we've got uh, tatiana's signed swimming cap on our love shane showcase here well, what was it like for you watching that performance i've got chills um reminded me so much of cameron um and and just the perfect build-up you know um i think tatiana she uh, a lot of people don't know this, but she, you know, she just missed the Olympics in 2016 by I think one one hundredth of a second. So she didn't go to the Olympics and she didn't give up. She came back. She was on the radar at the Commonwealth Games after that, and all the um, the swimming pundits, you know, started to see her move up the ladder and uh, just absolutely perfect. Everything has just been perfect, and I must give. Big credit to her coach, uh, you know, Rocco Marion has been coaching for a long time. This is his first big superstar, but they managed everything just perfect. Not getting too excited, not, not you know, celebrating before the final. Um, and uh, to break the world record in the Olympic final, it doesn't get more pressure. You know, like pressure than that, and more special than that. So, uh, and that—that's the same thing that Cameron did, um, you know, in London. And uh, so, I think it's the beginning of something great. There's Rocco sitting over there. It's the beginning. It's not the end for her. And that'll be the